Hello everyone, my name is Lü Jiaxuan. I'm a student from UPM. Today I'm going to interview my friend from China. She is our first interviewee. Now we can start our interview. First of all, the development of social media technology has been very rapid in recent years. What kind of impact do you think social media technology has had on your life? Well, for me, the development of social media technology has broadened my circle of friends. I can reach all kinds of people, and I will often post videos and photos on my social media. For example, Instagram and uh, Weibo. I have an uh, opportunity to meet friends with the same hobby. We can talk together. And uh, I often learn about news on social media. Compared to traditional newspaper and uh, magazines, I prefer to browse news on social media. I think this is very convenient and fast. It broke my traditional impression of reading news, and uh, reading news on social media reduced the use of newspaper and magazine, which is an environmentally friendly lifestyle. Okay, let's move to the second question. Does the development of social media technology has any negative effect on you? Uh, definitely yes. Everything has two sides. Social media and the development are getting better and better. We will also become more and more dependent on the social media. Maybe I spend three hours on social media every day. Kind of waste of time. There are also social media applications that will reduce the time I spend with people around me. When I focus on electronic devices instead of people, I quickly get bored. For people who frequently use social media, they may lose themselves in the virtual online world and pay too much of attention to other people's comments and likes. Oh, I think the lack emitted from the electronic screen will affect the quality of my sleep, making me think that it's now time to sleep. Without additional distractions, it is difficult to get enough sleep at night. So I think it is better not to keep the phone beside you when you sleep at night. Yes, I agree with your point of view. I think that sometimes I also spend a long time on social media, which makes me troubled. I think I have a previous space on social media, so I sometimes feel greedy. So, how do you think the development of social technology should be treated correctly? What will you do in the future? Well, the development of social technology has essentially improved communication efficiency and uh, promoted social and uh, economic development. In the future, I will treat social media correctly, establish a correct concept of time, and uh, maintain self-discipline. Internet chat has the character to so fast, timely, equal, and free. So internet chat, I can talk to the interaction with many people who don't know each other, help each other, and talk to each other. But I will definitely now to adapt it to the feeling of virtual reality. Thank you very much for your answers. This is the end of our interview today. Hope to see you next time. Hello, everyone. My name is Lü Jiaxuan. Today, I'm going to interview my friends. Uh, please introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Zi Yi. Okay. Uh, are you ready to answer my question? Yes. Okay. I'm uh, ready. Uh, firstly, what kind of the technology development do you think has brought the convenience to your life, such as online shopping? Mm -hmm. Online shopping for me, I think the development of e-commerce, such as online shopping, has brought great convenience to my life. Um, I can browse and buy what I want on the internet without going out. An express will 
delivering my goods to my home, which has brought great convenience to my life. Yes, uh, I very agree with you.、This、I think the yeah, I'm quietly agree with you. Um,、mm, to be honest, I often use the Taobao to online shopping. How about you? I me too. I often use Taobao. Yeah, in China, it's very convenient. Or Tianbao. Yeah. Yes, it's very popular. Well, the second question: Do you think the online shopping has a negative impact on you? Mm, mm, sure. I think there are both advantages and disadvantages. Disadvantages on that. Although online shopping brings convenience to us, to my life, but sometimes also make me become lazy. And I think that online shopping is not conducive to the return of goods. When I am not satisfied with my purchase item or it doesn't fit me, I usually need to spend a lot a, a lot of time and process to apply for a re refund. So that, I think that is not very convenient for online shopping. Yes, uh, I'm quietly agree with you. Because uh, every coin has two sides. Online shopping is same. Everything、mm. has the negative impact and the positive effect. Um, the third question: Do you think、mm. how to uh yeah? Do you think how to trace the development of online shopping technology gradually?、Mm. In my opinion, a large part of the reason why people shop online is that online shopping brings convenience to people. So the speed of express delivery and satisfaction of goods are very important to customers. When customers are not satisfied with the goods they get, it will be more conducive to. To the improvement of this technology to make the return faster and simplify the process, I think this is the important reason. I'm very agree with you, because、mm -hmm. uh, a large part of reason why people shopping online is online shopping bring convenient to people, but if、mm -hmm. not convenient for people, it's a bad effect. I think the technology of online shopping will have change. Today, our interview is already finished. Thank you for your answer. Welcome. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye.、Uh, hello, everyone. My name is Liu Jiaxuan. Today, I'm very pleased to interview my friends. Please introduce yourself. Hello, everyone. My name is Wei. I'm a student from UPM. Yeah.、Uh, before our interview, we have already introduced ourselves. Let's start our interview. Can you answer some questions? Yes. Yes. The development of the new technology has brought many change to our lives.、Mm. Um. What kind of technology do you think change your lifestyle?、Mm, I think、uh, online education change my life. You know, always I have to go to school and、uh, face to face with my、uh, daughter, my classmates. But now I just open my phone and I can see them on my phone. It's very convenient.、Mm, I also can learn a lot of things from. Uh, online education. Yeah, we can learn a lot of knowledge from our online class. But the, during the epidemic, how do you attend the class?、Mm, I always use Zoom, use Google Meet. Hmm. In some class, daughter like to use、uh, Google Classroom.、Okay. Yeah. Compare with the traditional way of class, which kind of the class do you prefer? Hmm. Actually, I like online class because um, 
uh, online class really save time. So now I don't need to go to school and uh, I'm an international student. Online class let me have a lot of time to uh, to stay with my family member. Yes, that's all. What do you think can be improved with the development of online course technology? Um, uh, I think best, I don't think anything can be improved. Yeah, the technology have development is very real. Yes. And I believe in the future we can depend on the technology to do anything without the time limitation, space limitation. Yes, you are right. Yeah. Uh, thanks for your answer. Yeah, welcome. Yeah, today our interview is already finished. Hope we can see you next time. Bye bye.